Welcome back. I have a quick video for you today. First off, I wanted to apologize for the screen brightness here. When I did the drive, it looks like the dark skies contrasted and brightened up my Model Y display here. This video is well worth your time though. As I started this drive, I came across a car accident right in the middle of the first intersection I was passing, and I was curious to see how FSD was going to react to that. How would it analyze the cars in different directions? Uncoming traffic? Traffic lights? How natural would it be? Would it be hesitant? Would it annoy the drivers behind me? Let's check it out. Let's start off with the left turn here. Oncoming traffic. Vehicle facing us is going to be turning left, but FSD waits for it to pass and then slowly moves and does the left turn. I would appreciate if this was a little bit faster than it was. All right, we're now coming up to that intersection and I can already see there's an issue right there. There's a car that looks like that it's stopped there in the middle of the intersection. We've got a lot of traffic slowing down. Right now I'm thinking, how is FSD gonna manage this? Is it gonna be stuck behind these vehicles? Is it gonna feel scared? Is the wheel gonna start jittering left and right as FSD decides what to do? Let's see what happens. All right, the cars are moving forward. We have some vehicles that look like they're gonna merge in front of us. FSD is doing the right thing and staying in the lane, letting those vehicles move in front of us, not cutting them off. FSD is not going around these vehicles right now. It's taking its time. It can't see right now that there's an accident in front right now, so it's just waiting. We're gonna pause here to see what FSD is gonna to have to go and analyze. Okay, we have a stopped vehicle there on the right. FSD is not going to be able to go around that vehicle. We have a vehicle there in the middle, and we have some oncoming traffic on the left. Essentially, there's only one place that the vehicle can go through, and that's in between the oncoming traffic and the vehicle there in front of us. Let's see how FSD actions this. No hesitation. Slowly goes through, accelerates, and just like that, FSD takes me through the accident smoothly and safely. I was concerned that it may take too much time, get confused, and I would have had to intervene as the cars behind me would become impatient. But there were zero issues there, and I was greatly pleased with that. Just think what needs to go into calculating all of that, and to do it safely and without intervention. That's real next level stuff there. All right, coming to a right turn here at a busy intersection. There's gonna be a lot of vehicles coming from the left. Let's see how FSD safely manages this intersection. All right, slowing down, coming to a full stop. Wheels slightly turn to the right and FSD is creeping forward, not going too quickly, waiting for the vehicles to pass and then accelerates and makes a smooth right turn. Great job. One thing I had noticed on the latest build of FSD was that it was moving me into the appropriate lanes in advance of upcoming turns. Right here I'm still in the right lane, but I'll have to be turning left in a few seconds. I'm monitoring to see when FSD will move me in as it's getting tight and there's multiple cars on my left. I'm afraid I'm going to miss the left turn at this rate. As you can see, FSD is not slowing down to get me behind those cars, nor is it accelerating to get ahead of them right now. I actually have a bit of concern right now that I'm really going to go miss that left turn. There's still an opportunity to get in front of these vehicles, but FSD is going to have to do that very quickly. And also I'm concerned that it's going to be too tight and I'm afraid I'm going to be cutting off these vehicles on the left. Let's see how FSD manages it. Okay, we passed one vehicle. Now we just have two vehicles on the left. Let's see if it squeezes in between these. At the top of this hill is when we're going to have to start making that left turn. All right, and FSD squeezes in there, one, one lane. Now it's got to move over one more lane as well to get into the left turn lane. And it does so nicely too. Okay, so it was a little bit tight, but it wasn't anything that was jarring or dangerous to the vehicles on the left. It actually did a very good job there. In previous versions of FSD, I probably would have missed that left turn. Another buttery smooth left turn from FSD Beta there. I don't take that for granted as in previous versions it sometimes had challenges with that.
I'm highlighting this right turn because FSD is going to do something it's never done at this location and at many other locations. As I turn right, the right lane is going to come to an end. FSD would never signal here and would ride the lane all the way to the end before quickly jumping over the lane before I hit the curb. This was disconcerting and not good behavior. On 1149, I got the signal and moved well in advance. That's great to see. All right, really busy intersection over here. Tons of oncoming traffic. We have an advanced green. FSD is moving forward. Let's see if it's going to punch it and go through. The light is changing. It senses the cars are moving forward and it does the right thing, slows down, and will now let the vehicles pass. Still waiting its turn, doing an analysis of the vehicles coming forward. Light's about to change. Moving forward, oh, does a good job there, slowing down, letting that car pass, fantastic job there, nice and safe, and then makes the left turn. That was good, it didn't jump the gun there, the cameras were able to sense that there was a speeding oncoming car, it waited for it to pass, and even though the light had turned, it waited its turn, and then made the appropriate and safe decision. Great job. To finish off our drive, FSD will take a left turn into the shopping mall, and hats off to FSD on this drive. Today, the areas of improvement were all in the areas of safety and stability. FSD expertly managed going around the traffic incident without delay and very smoothly. FSD continues to show great left turn behavior, smooth, more predictable, and very human-like. FSD has also improved on signaling out of lanes coming to an end, a big improvement on previous versions for me. And FSD continues to be cautious and safe in busy intersections. Its camera detections caught that vehicle that was gunning it through the red light and kept me safe. I want to thank you for watching this quick video and I hope you learned something new about full self-driving today. As always, I enjoy your comments so please leave some below. You all drive safe and I'll see you on the roads.